speak today, so I get all the time. Um, so another reason I should be the favorite child, putting it out there. Um, all right, I am always the kid of a cute that's accused of missing my parents' wedding anniversary every year. So I'm gonna have to make this memorable in case I forget to call you this week. Okay. All right. So tonight we party, but their real anniversary is on the 18th. So there's still a few days left for you to really mess this up, Dad. Okay. okay, so mom and dad may have been married for 49 years and 360 days today, uh, but my husband, Dave, and I have been married for almost 17 years. So, Thank God for sharing. So, they're saying it's crackly. Can you hear me if I just talk yes. loudly? Yeah. 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 You can talk loudly. Yeah, it's distorting. Okay. Badly. All right. Okay, so um, I'll start at the beginning. No, I'm kidding. Okay. Mom said no. She's already done. Okay. Um, Mike? Mike? They can't hear you back here. I can stand there and relay it. She said. Test, 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 test. Okay, so I'm gonna put it really close this way. Is that better? Okay. All right, so my husband and I have been married for almost 17 years. It feels like 50 sometimes, but um, it has only almost been 17. Um, so I thought I'd take this opportunity to take some of the critical moments and points in time of mom and dad's 50 years of marriage and use it as a learning opportunity for Dave and I. And you all just get to listen. I'd rather ask by your friend, he said what? Is the father of that you saw? You lost your 15 years in your marriage. I said it, it's very simple. And that is the one part is love. You've got to love each other. The second part is patience. And that is twice the love. That's it. You guys all need hearing aids. <laughs> Sorry. That's a touchy topic. Thank you. 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 Okay. 